All right, so this is the, the seat of an 1103 Ultra, just like you have on your chair. So when you take the seat off your chair, take the arms off, put the arms on the ground, loosen up the bracket here, and then you can take the whole seat off. Then flip it upside down like this. So when you look in the bottom of the seat, this is what you see. You see the bracket here. So the first thing you'll do right here where my fingers are at, there's a little lever. You can see I'm squeezing. When you squeeze this, it allows for this piece to come out of here. So this piece comes out. When you squeeze these two levers, that piece will come out. So that's the first thing you'll do, stick that piece out. I'm just gonna put it there for a minute. I'm sending you six wood screws, three washers for each, six washers. All right, so I want you to do this. First thing you do is you'll take the bar out from, we want the front bar out. So that's a 716 bolt. I'm gonna use my drill, it's a little quicker. So you're gonna take the bar out up front. You're gonna leave the screws in like this. What you're gonna do is you're gonna add three screws on each side. So three screws on each side. There may be a better way to do this, but. All right, so I've got three screws, and you're gonna put it back in the same holes they came out with. And use the three screws I'm sending you. Don't use two, use all three of them. And then you'll tighten it up. Okay? The reason we need to space this out because this is the bar you're getting. When I put the bar under here, and we put this piece back on, it's not gonna shut because it's too tight. But now with a little bit of spacers, it'll work. So now you'll put your bar here, okay? You're gonna bring your bracket back, you hook it in the back, you go to the front, and the front you gotta squeeze these levers, let the bar fall in there, okay? If, if these levers don't go all the way open to, to shut, all you have to do is just, you see how they're shut now? This locks, this locks them. So again, this unlocks it, this pulls this out, and these. All right, so now, well, before you lock them, get this bar all the way up to the end of the edge hedges. Okay, you don't want to go over this because that's going to give you more height, just right to the end of here. Now you've got the bar on and you've got it pretty much the same distance on both sides. Now, go ahead and make sure this is locked. Okay, so now you got the bar there. Take your wood screws, and you see there's three holes. So you're gonna do one here. Two. Three. Four, five. All right, so now you've got your anchor bar on here. It's not going anywhere. It's pressed down by the, the metal and it just, this just keeps it from going this way with six screws. This is where you would hook up your strap to your chair, to your seat. So this is the bar. This is how you do it. Hi, I'm Mark. And my name is Alex. We are a family owned business for over 25 years. We have many products available, not just what you see in this video. If you would like to learn more, you can call the number below at 800-677-6293 or you can visit us directly at www.marksmobility.com.